think you want me And I guess in a way you do Holding my breath on reveling emotions I need some space to think this through Call me on now <laughs> You're beautiful too, mommy. Thank you. Thank you, mommy. Chum.
Mira esta mamá. You look like a young lady. What did you say? A winter. That's a winter. Yes. <laughs> you guys do know a winter. Disco madam. Disco. I'll attach a picture here. You can so you can see a winter. The TV is loud. I'm watching um the Asunta case. Yeah. So you said that's a winter. Okay, and I'm here trying to sew the dress. <laughs> and by the way, guys, my seats are clean and they are they have dried actually because we even, I'm even sitting on one. Yeah, I'm in love. I'm in love. It's so clean. Yeah, so. I need to take them back. I put them here at the center because the fan was supposed to blow them. Another yeah, so I'll take them back to where they're supposed to be in a shot. Uh huh. What style is that? <laughs> wow. Okay, let me finish up. I'll catch you guys later. What outfit is that? Nigerian outfit. Huh? Nigerian outfit. Nigerian outfit. Yes. Oh, wow, that's pretty. Oh, okay, nice. Baby designer. Designer Guentalier. Your eyebrows are looking funny. I wish I didn't <laughs> shape them. <laughs> Baby, mm -hmm. Ebu come closer. Guys, what do you think? She looks like a grown up. <laughs> Forgive me, guys. Okay, go back to your seat. Oh my god. Look at me again. Why? <laughs> guys, I'm finally done. <laughs> And I got tired at some point. As you can see, on this side, I was doing some back stitches, but they're taking so long. So I had to shift to, what do you call this type of running stitches? Yes. So these ones are quicker than this, but these ones are more firm than this. Yes. So here's our dress. She said she wanted a dera. So 
That's it. So let's put the baby. You, you, you turn it. Turn it inside down, like inside out. Like this. Then you, you put on the doll. her to dress up the doll let me show you so i went and got this because i want to to wear my wig i'll be showing you i'm trying something i ordered for uh the the, the whatever the the gel for the wig the stick glue and what and the band and all that so i want to try my wig with glue and then see i was saying that's why i went and got this something that i is some um something good for wig like wig lines and then rasters here i hope you guys can see ah uh, yeah so yeah i'll be doing that video tomorrow uh yeah because i want to try it with you guys i've never styled a wig with glue and whatnot on my own so i know nothing i don't even know how to lay the edges so i'm just going to do my stuff i'll watch on the on youtube and i'll try to do it myself and we'll okay, see how it will ready. turn out yeah we're ready you're done let me finish wow oh my goodness that's pretty let me see oh you guys see i did an amazing oops i did an amazing job okay hold her properly then i did an amazing job i want to see this the tie here the tie yes Oh, you've taken an extra fabric. Oh, nice. Oh, this is nice. Pretty. That's pretty. Are you happy? Yes. So now you let mommy watch, okay? Okay. Yeah. So guys, bye. Let's catch up tomorrow. Hey, guys. Good morning. Good morning. I just woke up so the energy is not up to your standards i know but it's fine i'll catch up as we go on with the vlog yeah so um uh, i want to make uh, breakfast with you guys i want to cook some uh, buns i don't know why we call them buns and uh, buns is something different like the ones that you make uh, bag away. So, um, okay, whoever taught me, my auntie, they used to call them buns, but uh, they have like small mandazis. You'll see the small pastries. If you know the name, comment down below and tell me what the name is. Then from there, we'll be calling them that name henceforth. But they're very delicious. They they're just something that I really love for my breakfast. Yeah, uh, I'll start off by uh, making tea. I'll make my tea and then I'll continue with the baking here, as you see. Then yeah, it's very simple with simple ingredients. Yeah, so stay tuned and enjoy. So guys, these are the ingredients that you need for the buns. Your flour, and make sure the flour is self-raising. If not, just uh, use the normal flour and um, baking powder. Then here I have milk, blue band, sugar, and egg. 
make sure okay if you don't if you don't mind the scent of too much egg use two or more depending on how many months you want to make for me i'll just use one i always use one no matter the quantity okay i've never prepared so many but i always use one egg because i don't like the smell of egg in my in my buns yeah so let's begin we start with the sugar sugar I use two and a half. Margarine. it looks first of all you want to melt the salt so that it doesn't create the particles in your mixture you add your milk you try just to use the whisk The sugar has melted. Don't mind the margarine. Make sure you sift your flour to create more more air spaces. The, the, uh, the proportion for my flour because you This is enough. Or should I add more? There's no harm. That's enough. They don't grow bad easily, so you can uh, eat them for a week. Yeah. So once you're done with that, you want to go in with your hands and make sure your hands are clean. I had washed my hands already. You need properly. It's it's smelling so nice. It smells like a cake. And guys, don't use water. Just use milk for good flavors.
so guys um as as you've seen it's very simple make sure you prepare this uh for your loved ones at home even you just try it for yourself they are very spongy just like a cake and they smell like a cake they are very yummy so i'm going to be having my milk tea together with my baby girl Let me test one for you guys. I really love them. I prepare them most of the time so I know the taste and I never go wrong with them. They're very yummy. So go try this for your loved ones and enjoy. Thank me later. Comment down below if you found the name for these uh, things. Comment down and then we will stop calling them buns. Uh, three to four years back, I prepared the same on my YouTube channel. You can just go back if you want a more detailed video. Because as you've seen, I've not done something detailed. But it's simple and easy to understand. Like I had sugar, margarine, blah, blah, blah. I mix them up, I spread, I cut them. And then deep fry. Turn the other side and you're done. It's as simple as that. For my tea... Mm, my tea it's just um tea leaves tea masala you can add a few flavors the way you want it and again for the buns you can also add flavor like uh, cardamom no cinnamon camera you can add flavors like cinnamon um vanilla essence the flavors that you love just try and explore do a few things me i've tried the uh, cinnamon and i've tried um vanilla those two flavors and they're very nice so guys enjoy uh lunch we are going to have leftover rice i cooked in surplus yesterday night and we are going to have it with the uh, fruits dressed with the um, Chia seeds, uh, chocolate syrup, and uh, yogurt. Later in the day, I changed my nails. At the beginning of the vlog, you've seen they were looking so bad. They needed a good refill and uh, changed the art as well. The art is in Halloween. My daughter chose that for me. And uh, I don't mind. <laughs> Right there, I was trying to let to to see if the camera can focus clearly, but I'm going to attach pictures, so don't worry. Next day in the morning, we have some brave girl right there. I took off her, her tooth that was wiggling. Yeah, and uh, I'm so proud of her. It's not her first tooth, so she didn't even cry like the first first day. <laughs> 